I be so sick of you niggas, y'all can't you think me? I be so bold myself, girl, you come and fuck me. I feel so ordinary, said when you won't ground me. Treat me like God, why you wear me out? Are you me you tear me out? Treat me about you. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to Ebony Maria. My name is Elle. Happy Thursday. Y'all, I am exhausted. I did not pick, pick up the camera because I had a lot going on. Basically, long story short, my dog went into labor yesterday. Um, I had to rush home because she was starting, you know, and it went on all night long. Like, we was doing everything, make her comfortable, leaving her alone, you know, making sure the lights weren't overbearing for her um, or overstimulation for her. Um, just all kind of stuff, y'all. And when I say we end up, um, oh, my door's open. Hold on. We didn't go to bed. I know to after 1 30, 2 o'clock in the morning, and every 30, 40 minutes of those hours, still, we were up and we kept like waking up and kept having to go check on her. And then finally, at like 3 a.m. in the morning, we saw a puppy, half of a puppy. Um, and she was basically trying to eat it. She, she, she did eat it. I, it, she did eat the dog. But, so, um, we got up, you know, at that point we was panicking. We were trying to make sure she was okay. We were trying to see. At this point, she had knocked the camera over that we had on her. So, even when we went back to look at the footage, it just showed it was over. So, it showed like it was covered up with like a light color because it fell into the carpet. Um, and it, I'm just, I'm exhausted, y'all. We finally just got her home from the vet. Like, at, it's like 1040 this morning. She we just got her from the vet. So, me and him about to just grab something to eat so we can go home and try to eat. And honestly, find some sleep because we exhausted. We've been up all day um, with these puppies. You know, we're trying to hurt her to deliver puppies. Um, on the bright side, she is okay. Um, she's not suffering from any major infections or anything. Um... Okay, hold on, y'all. Yeah, y'all, sorry, I'm back. Um, but I forgot where I was at, honestly. Overall, she's okay. Um, she doesn't have an infection right now. They gave her antibiotics because her uterus was kind of swollen. And she has, like, some excessive fluid. They wanted to try to get off of her before it do cause an infection. So we just got to kind of watch over the next 14 days, make sure she's doing okay, not feeling sick. But... Yeah, and it was a lot of people, right? Because I shared it with my social media or whatever, and there was a lot of people had basically asking questions, which is fine because, like, if you don't breed dogs or if you don't have mostly bigger dogs, you never understand it because um, especially little dogs and stuff like that. They do it too, but most people don't breed little dogs or they don't breed, you know, so um, it is coming. It's very coming. If you Google it, it's very coming for dogs, especially bigger dogs. Like I said, certain, certain breeds to eat their dogs eat their puppies um if they feel like something is wrong with them so like if they're sick or if they come out dead the the mama will absorb the dog back and they, they, that's just how it is however i've been new this because i've had i think that happened before with some of our other dogs and just even in general with, with being around a lot of people breed dogs we've heard it happen oh uh, well, even if you've been in dog fights it's kind of like what they train dog fighters to do like to eat their other dogs or whatever but we never seen it first hand like seeing the actual like we had it happen one time with our dog's mom my dog now her mom when she had her that litter there was one dog that was sick but we caught her like she we we came in she was trying to put him in her mouth trying to eat him and we caught her and we isolated the dog however we should have probably let her eat him because i think he did still end up suffering like he was a happy dog don't get me wrong but his back legs had an issue where he couldn't stand up and his chest was flat so it would never inflate you can go ahead so we can't have that <laughs> i know we came back i'm insured hey i i gotta, I gotta get, get him on camera he gotta do it again now, hey he let him know what, what did you say when i pulled up i was like hey mr jd <laughs> Yeah, so we better get so, something to eat, y'all, because um, babe, I want the I want a, the number one spot the chicken sandwich meal. Okay, number one chicken sandwich meal. Um, what drink would you like with that, ma'am? Uh, you can go Sprite. A Sprite, yes, yes ma'am. Thank you. My pleasure. And we're we'll about to get us something to eat, y'all. And that's a shame, yes, we come to this oh, Chick fil A too much. Like these people know this man's name. Like, you, you know. 8, 12, um, and 30. 
Let me do it So, um, but we about to some eat, y'all. But in all in all, it's been a long day. I am very sleepy. I just want to sleep. I do not care about nothing else right now. I'm just sleep. Like, I'm sleep deprived because you got to think about it. We've been up since we went to work. Uh, it's Polynesian for me. Polynesian. Um, we've been do, up uh, barbecue and since we went to work yesterday. Yes. So then to get off work and do visits uh, and drive and come home each. and still uh, just be yeah. up all day working with a dog, make sure she's not going, make sure she don't need to see sick. You know, it's, it's just like it's really okay, a lot. So I got one Chick Fil A sandwich. So I am out. Because I ain't lie, I'm about to eat. It's already gloomy. It's probably for the rain. I'm about to eat. I'm about to go home and document the visits I did yesterday. And oh, I'm about to get in my bed, and I need a nap or okay. two because I'm tired. Now y'all stay safe out here. <laughs> Thank you. Bye YouTube. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> and um, I'm I'm just I'm tired. So yeah, we'll be back, y'all. Hey y'all, welcome back, y'all. I'm still tired. I was able to get some rest, but of course you know I still had to like work and stuff and. I was, we ate Chick-fil-A early this morning and I was watching Grey's Anatomy. And baby, before I know it, it was watching me. And, um, it's a car. And, uh, yeah. And now we just not really getting up, getting up, getting, you know, up, up. we to go pick up these kids. And I think we're going to go get eat CC's because I want a good salad. I used to like Mazio's salad, but they don't have one here, so... I guess we're gonna settle for CC's the way the kids can eat pizza and you know the buffet all they want and then I can enjoy me a nice salad. Okay. But yeah, and it definitely rain. It poked y'all. We we were under the weather. When I say well we weren't under the weather, we were under the bed. When I say that weather had us knocked out, baby, all I know is I heard I, I thought I heard something in my sleep, so I jumped up. Baby, I looked at the all I heard was the wind and I said okay get what I did turn right on and <laughs> went back to sleep I was like dang on tired and I'm still tired y'all so I know tonight once we actually go eat and get home get them kids settled get their bass up out the way baby I'm gonna tap out I already know it I might watch one episode of Grey's Anatomy or something baby I already know I'm gonna be knocked out they be killing me with this mm -hmm. but yeah so we hit it to get them and then go get something to eat and I'll be back. That's just a little update for right now. Peace. Hey y'all, welcome back to Ebony Maria. I am Eb. If you're new here, thank you so much for subscribing and joining our team. Y'all, it is Friday, finally. So I actually have been up, Um, I'm late starting the vlog. It's noon, but of course I've been up. I took my kids to school. Um, I even had a morning transport I had to do and I had to go back and pick them up later today. Um, I'm trying to see what I need to put y'all So yeah, I got up this morning. I actually ended up getting up early for some reason. I don't know. My body just kind of got up. So I got up, took a hot shower, did some um, prayer and did a little meditating just kind of get my mind right i started cleaning up my living room um i didn't come back on the camera yesterday but even when i made it home i just was in a one of those moods where i can't figure out what's going on so it makes me just kind of just randomly do stuff so i actually ended up cleaning up my whole kitchen um getting all the food out of the fridge all the stuff we just need to throw out before monday for a trash day run. i ended up doing that last night i ended up vacuuming out the floors and mopping and sweeping and stuff so it was literally just a burst of energy when we came from um from cc's uh cc's was good the salads was really good we were so mad that they took the eggs out from the salad so now we got to find a new salad place that has everything we like between the eggs meat all that and they also took the meat off the thing so i'm like dang cc's y'all are no longer reliable for salads because all y'all have is lettuce and, and some topping vegetable toppings like pickles cucumbers cheese peppers baby where's the meat i can't get no meat i can't get no egg no more like yeah so, but all in all, the kids enjoyed. They was uh, they ate a lot of pizza and stuff, and the little desserts they be having. And we came back home, and I cleaned up. Um, uh, me and my husband kind of rotated the laundry. He threw some in the washer. I threw it in the dryer. I started folding some of the clothes. I actually gotta go put them up because I did fold them up this morning when I woke up this morning, but I didn't put them up. So then I started getting my son ready. I had to actually wake my baby girl up today because normally she's up. And today, last night, I think she told me her side came on late last night, like 2 o'clock in the morning. So she ended up taking a bath. I said, baby, that's how you know I don't hear nothing. I was asleep. I ain't hear nothing. Look at her. This is how she like to do, y'all. 
Look, she mad I'm talking about her. <laughs> so um she jumped down. <laughs> she be getting mad when I put on camera. But um yeah, so I ended up having to wake her up and Josiah. So we got them on up and got on off to school and I went ahead and picked up my kid. I had to go by the office and get a seat, actually. And then I went and picked him up to take him to his visit. And then I had to go back and pick them up at six uh, for that visit. And then, I, like I said, when I came back home, I lit my candles. Oh, I got some new candles. Let me show y'all. So, I love candles, y'all, but I love candles on a budget. Like, don't get me wrong. I love Bath & Body Works, but if I had to spend my money, it, it's not going to be Bath & Body Works. So, y'all, this is... I love these. I'm, I'm, I'm so proud of Dollar General. Oh, somebody took the... Oh, no, it was on top. It was a, a top on top. This meal... So good. It's vanilla something, but these are only five bucks. And oh, here it is. I put it in here. Vanilla clouds. And then I got this other one. And I love True Living, y'all. They have a lot of stuff. It's tobacco vanilla. It's kind of like that manly sweet. So this one's gonna go in our room because my husband does like to do like teak wood and stuff like that. And the last one he had in the room, it smelled really good, which is what I have over here in the um in my workspace because yeah we had to clean it up because this is where this is where she gave birth we had the playpen it's still here for now and as you can see you can see kind of where stuff got real um and we had the playpen here so now he didn't came in and scrubbed the floor um and vacuumed it and stuff so but this is another one we actually got this one from hobby lobby and i said never again because i think this damn thing was like yeah, fifteen ninety nine for this little can. When I can go to Dollar General and get the same one, five. But it does smell good. It's coconut patchouli or something, patchouli, whatever. But it kind of got a masculine smell, but also kind of like sweet. So, and that's I just got through working over there, y'all, because I did just upload the vlog for today. It's late. I'm sorry, y'all. Bear with me, y'all. Know I be on the move sometimes. So sometimes. Um, and normally I do all my videos over the weekend. I upload so much content on my camera. Like I download and use up so much storage on the camera. So that by the when the weekend come, I can have it chopped for about like Monday. At least Monday and Wednesday will kind of be out the way. But this week, it wasn't like that. I was late all this week. So <laughs> bear with me, y'all. But um, I just want to show y'all my candles. Because y'all, I love candles. Oh, and we got us another fan because... For some reason, the fan in here, we didn't check it. Like It just wasn't one of the things you just said, let me see if the fan works. It does work, but it's making this funny noise like the blade is hitting or the blade is doing something. So we weren't playing with it. So um, we put it on our list for our landlord to come fix it. He told us, he, you know, he's going to get to it. But for some reason, oh, once again, we keep getting the houses where... The room stay cold, cold, cold. The living room stay cold. Everybody else's room stay cold. Then at nighttime, our room is hot. Again. So we like, bro, what the? So as long as the door is kind of open, it'll kind of bring a breeze. But as soon as you close the door, after a certain temperature, it get kind of hot in here. And my husband is a sweater. So, y'all, last night, it's funny because he put the fans together and we was watching Grey's Anatomy. He was like... Oh, she, he was like, uh-uh, man. He was like, you you going to talk about me because I'm always the cold. But he was like, hey, I got to turn this Oh, He was like, I got to turn this fan off, bro. This this mud is ice cold. I'm freezing, bro. He, he had to cover over his head and everything. I said, uh-uh, not you cold. But when I be freezing, it's the problem. So we just had went, because like I said, he was off yesterday because of our, you know, our dark situation. He had just ended up still taking the whole day off or whatever. And after we got her home we was going back out so we can go get our chick-fil-a because uh at first we was going to take her home and go to sam's by the time we did that it was like let's just go to dollar store and go to go to go to chick-fil-a get some eat boo eat a bar but tissue paper time we were just kind of walking through the dollar store because just because because we don't never just 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 because <laughs> and that's when i end up finding some new candles so if y'all check y'all local dollar general they do have good candles and you can smell them when i say every time i light those candles I can smell it. Oh, don't judge my dresser. I need to clean it off. But I got one right here, too. That one is almost gone, though. That's why I got it in here. It's from Dollar General. And that big old candle is $5. Uh-oh, sorry. It was $5. So, that's why. I... I'm about to beat her ass, y'all. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm about to beat my cat ass. Because why? I, I don't even know what she knocked down. I just heard it going I just heard it up, but I think it was my blinds. Piper. What the hell she at? I hear her. 
But I also hear. Girl, I think she, y'all, she she just jumped down. She climbed her ass up there. So I'm like, what is all that milk? Look at her. Go sit down somewhere. Get go sit down. I don't care. Yeah, you me either. Well. Yeah, she be, she hard headed. She she be talking back, y'all. So, but I was trying to make sure she didn't uh knock some down, y'all. I'm like, what was that? But yeah, so I just want to come check in and say happy Friday, cause of course I didn't I didn't get to come. And then after I did all that running around, I started loading the video. And if you know, once you clip, look, once you connect that camera to the uh computer to load your videos if you unplug it stuff on CapCut it says your stuff is not available so I was trying to fix that first you know so but yeah so I'll be back later um I'm actually about to call my husband because he wanted to go eat tacos today he said his workload was light but it's about to storm and I'm just gonna be honest I don't want to get out there in this storm I don't want to get out there and go wait 30 minutes like because I'm thinking I want to run up the window and go get me a chicken box but I'm also like I don't want to get out in the storm, period. So it might be looking real like fix me a sandwich and wait till he come home. I'm just going to be honest. But, so I'll call y'all. Um, look me, I'll say I'll call y'all back. I'm be, see y'all later because I'm finna call him. <laughs> see y'all later. I'll be back, y'all. Okay, y'all. I am back and I am well rested. I am up and I threw on my clothes. I got on a little... It's kind of a turtleneck, but it's also the arms out, so it's still summerish with the little necklace. And I got on some, just some highway jeans with the kicks, cause I am about to go transport my kids back home. But I'm also after that meeting the girls for girls' night, so yeah. And then it's after five, so technically I can have on what I want to wear. Which we can wear these type of shirts to work. We just can't wear those jeans in the office, but on our visits. That I don't really care. And I'm not visiting. I'm just picking up, dropping off. Picking up, dropping off. So, yeah. I'm excited to be going out. Now, girls' night is real chill. We're not going anywhere fancy. But, honestly, I get tired of looking like a complete bomb 24-7. Because I'm always either in my robe, in dress, you know, in or in just some regular jeans that don't require holes when I'm doing my visits. Or something of that nature, you know. So, I wanted to wear something different, but I think I want to switch my jeans because these are bloody. Hold on, I'm gonna be back. Okay, so I did change my jeans because these are not as long and flooding. And I put on, I cut my tights, <laughs> which is not working out very well. The ones I had on yesterday because I told my husband they were too big anyway, and I was planning on throwing them out. So I just cut them to give me like a leg sleeve for now until i drop my kids off um and then when i drop them off i can just take it off but i did go with the more 90s jeans look of course and i'm putting my tennis shoes back on so yeah so that way because like i said it doesn't matter if we are going to chill um i just get tired of looking so raggedy you know like never having the mission to throw on any clothing and I kind of be tired of it. Oh, did I just scrape my shoe? Oh no, okay. I be tired of this, so I decided to throw on something. That way, you know, that way I can say I looked the part at least. And then I think hubby asked to go to the adult arcade when I come back with my friends. So that way I'll still be comfortable. Let's see. I'll still be comfortable. But y'all, these are my same pants that I told y'all about by, um, what was it called? Homecoming that year that had all the buds that I couldn't let up. So y'all know, in February, I realized I, for a Galentine, I was able to put them up. I was able to fit them. However, now, they're even less fitty. Like, I got room. On Valentine's, on Galentine, it was kind of like, I could build them up, but it was like, a little, like, if I ate the wrong food was like so now i'm like yay so i love that for me i know it's not so good on camera because when i turn the side i still look real rounded on camera and which it may look like in person but in actuality i've lost weight like and i'm loving it and now i'm working on this yeah i'm sick of 
Oh yeah, I gotta get rid of it. So I'm working on that now, but overall, I feel so much better. Like I say, I'm more groomed. This sleeve is not, look at y'all. It is not staying up. I done rolled it, I guess my thigh too dang thick. I shouldn't have cut it, but then I, if I would've cut it too loose, it wouldn't have came all the way up my thigh. I don't know at this point what to do. Cause I'm trying to, I think it's rolling down the back of my thigh. That's why it's not staying. I just need it to stay for now, for me to do this drop off. So it won't look so, you know, but at the end of the day, I don't even care. I don't even care, okay? But yeah, so I'm about to brush my teeth real quick. Um, and then I'm headed out the door. And that's just because I've been at home. I had a sandwich and I think I don't all, you know, I just don't want my breath to be changing. So, I'm going brush my teeth. Get that out the way. So, I can get out the door so I can go ahead and pick them up. Drop them all. So, my weekend can review me, okay? Oh, look at it. I got so out. Oh, my hair. Oh, yeah, I hope. I hate breaking my tongue. It's the worst part to me, but it's the most important part too. <laughs> it gets on my nerves. And y'all, for my electric flosser, I like to put warm water in it because that cold, cold water, baby, when it shoots your teeth, hold on, I think that's all hot water. My teeth aren't that sensitive, like they're getting better. Cause I used to have to use Sensodyne toothpaste, but, and then I let it shoot some out first, cause it could get cold in the valve. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. And I had to lean over cause it do get in rest. But it does work. It does work. And baby, let me tell y'all, they offer in my wash. It be better worse than the brand. It burns worse than the brand, baby. When I say my mouth, my jaw be feeling like. <laughs> God dog, but when I do, when I buy that regular Listerine, it don't feel like that. Oh, okay. I be like, mm -hmm. <sighs> And then the only other thing I'm gonna do is, oh, turn my thing on. Only other thing I'm gonna slap on is just the mascara. And I normally really wear mascara all the time. Like, I wear mascara to work because I just like it. Especially since my lashes aren't as luscious as they used to be. Like they used to be all long and pretty. And as I started getting eyelash extensions, they started looking bald. So I do, I put this on. Normally in the morning time when I had to go in the office anyway. Cause baby, I don't want nobody looking at me with no bald eyes. At least give them a little definition. Just a little. Just a little. And this is a, did I get this from TJ Maxx? I think I did, but I think I also found a website because I, when I first got it, I actually liked it, liked it, liked, liked. That did did it, I think that's the Mississippi slang shit we do, but I actually liked this brand. And so when I tried to find it, you know how TJ Maxx had one brand one day, next day it's gone. You know how they do. I found it online, but I didn't want to pay online price. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, but. It is a very good eyelash. Can you see it? Oh yeah. It's a good mascara. Smashbox. That was the brand. Okay, so yeah, guys. That's all I got to do. I gotta spray a little more perfume because I think I didn't, not a little more. I didn't put none on today. Um, look, I put say like cologne. Spray some perfume. And I be, I like this one my husband bought me. He bought me some more that 
I usually wear too, but I've been liking that one. That scent got a little spell on me. So, okay, that's it, y'all. I'll be back later when I link up with the girlies and when we go eat or whatever. And I'll be back. See y'all later. Oh, hey, y'all. Welcome back. I just got home. Y'all, I stopped and got me something to eat because hub and the kids got wings. I ain't get wings and I ain't get to make it out with the girls because my friend had an accident, y'all. So we end up not going. So I'm trying Portillo's or Portillo's for the first time. Everybody swear by it. Say it's so good. Um, it's regular cream cup fries, so they just fries. I got the chili cheese dog. And then the only thing I heard about all they hot dogs is on a poppy seed bun. So, I'm going to see how it's going to do or what it even looks like. Baby, fuck. What the rest of my hot dog? Uh-oh. Uh, the price. Uh-uh. It said just chili. I said no onions. No, it ain't got no onions, but what's this sauce? What is that, cheese? Probably. It didn't say that on the thing. Hold on, y'all. I don't know about that now. Is it cheese? Oh, and then they chili got beans. Okay, Portillo, whatever. Y'all already locked. Yeah. I like chili, no beans. Let me see if chili good, y'all. Mmm. Mmm. It's all right. This is what it look like. It's on a poppy seed bun. And it got beans on it, y'all. I know. Nobody like beans. So, let me see. I mean, they need to add some detail. Mm. I've been saying need some salt, but shoot, them fire salty in them. I'm really mad this got beans Ooh. on. Let me see, y'all. Mm. Mm. Oh, I'll never get a hot dog in. Mm -mm. <laughs> Is that a fucking dog? Oh, but then they don't even. Yeah. You gotta buy everything separate. Just drink the fry. It ain't. It ain't nasty, but the the shell to the hot dog is 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 rubbery. It's very it's very rubbery. What's rubbery? And it's mm hmm. Is this motherfucker old or something? I guess it's supposed to be like a, but they got Italian sandwiches too. So I don't they know if it's trying to make it like that real deal hot dog from like Chicago side. That's kind of how like. Well, I'm from I'm from Mississippi. I'm saying that's what they go If you was Chicago, how's out to like, Chicago, I would never buy it. I mean, not that, that's real rubbers. And it's salty. It's, it kind of reminds me, the salt reminds me of Sunny's Talk. If y'all ever ate Sunny's Chizzy Dog, y'all know how they hot dogs so salty. It's like that, but, y'all, mm -hmm. it's some. It's, I wish I could describe the texture to y'all. The skin, it's almost like, okay, you know how I could describe it. It's almost like they boil them and then grill them. And the grill part make it, the outside skin rubberish, but the inside tastes like boiled hot dog. If that makes sense. I don't really know if that makes sense or not. Um. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I could try to break it so I can see. Mm. I don't want to see that shit. They, like, they, they do want to see it. They want to see my experience of me eating this hot dog. Ain't that right? They said, yeah. He a hater, y'all. He be hating so bad. He, he just be wanting to say something because he be wanting to be on here. Just say on. put me I'm on the camera. I'm trying to be on. I'm just saying nobody want to see you eat no chewed up ass. Yes, they do. They want to know my experience from me trying to pour the kilos for the first time so that they can know, like, mm mm, F said, Chelsea died one good. I ain't getting it. They ain't going to see it. When they see you eating that chewed up food, then show they go, ugh. Oh, that shit. I didn't show them chewed up fucking food. I'm just food. saying, they ain't gonna want to see no damn food that you put out your damn mouth. I didn't show it to them. You was about to. You said I, I did. Can't eat it. About to, and they want to see it. It's two different things. Them folks don't want to see it. You hating or you mad? I'm not mad nor, nor hating you. He hating and he mad. Because ain't nobody. Watch your game. Shit, the fuck? Why you worry about me? Loud. I ain't talking loud. You talk loud. And why you dropping wings and shit? 
You want to see it? Nah, but I did when I just watched these damn covers. <laughs> Show, what was you doing? Your damn cat. Don't blame her. Yeah, she was. She Cause she probably was locked up. Cause they all be treating right her here. wrong when she I hear. She was right here watching me eat. Then okay, if she was watching you eat, what they got to do with she you? She jumped down, and when she jumped down, she jumped down and hit my arm. Like literally, but she jumped. X your side. She was sitting right here. Jojo talked me right at the door. You see, she got the zoomies out of nowhere. Uh, the zoomies over there, not over here. But she was right she here. jumped up here one but time while right eating hot dog. Because we both up here. That do my cat so wrong, y'all. She gonna bite that. I guess who ain't gonna say nothing. I'm like, Thank you, Jojo. Mind your business. Son, and that's my she be doing too much. You do too much. You what and your daddy. Look at her right now. Show them what she doing right now. She doing her usual. Poo poo on the on my on my desk stand. Just in the way. She ain't got. She ain't in the way. There. Ain't nobody over there. Pipe pipe. What you doing, girl? Look at her, y'all. She having her way in this chair. Ain't bothering nobody. Pipe. Ain't that right? Hey, Pipe Girl. What My you doing, God, girl? Oh, oh, Pipe oh. Girl. Look at him. Piper. Hey, Mama. What you doing? Uh, what you doing, huh? Who did that? That that did it. I believe you. I'm gonna beat his ass. Yeah, I'm gonna beat his ass. See? Hey, look, don't. Don't come out here with the bullshit. You know but look what she doing. She's sitting down. Yeah, she ain't bothering me. She, she want a french fry. You want a fry? These ain't McDonald's fries. I don't know if you're going to eat it. Mm, she looking like, what? Oh, damn. I, there you go. It's probably too salty for you. Or hard. That one looks a little burnt. It's too hard. Yes, I feed my cat french fries. She likes french fries. She really like McDonald's fries, but she eats. Other people fry too. What fry that well I gave her the other day she ate? She fucked that fry up. Look out. I don't give her no other type of food though. She don't eat fries. Mm -hmm. And it ain't a lot. It'd be like one or two. Yeah, but yeah. So, she's sitting she she sitting down. Yeah, she finna get zoomies. No, she's not. She's not finna get the zoomies. She finna zoom and get that shit. She had the zoomies earlier. On everything. I'm saying she just went crazy. She jumped right on my she, own. She knocked that plate in there early. And took our run. Mm -hmm. So yeah. she jumped up there. But yeah, so I ain't doing nothing. My parents got canceled, so I'm ready to eat this fries. I ain't I don't know about this hot dog. He's probably just gonna have to go in the government gonna take my loss because it's something with the texture. It's just too gummy. It's too rubbery. So I'll be back tomorrow, y'all. I see y'all later. Peace. No. Peace. Hey y'all, welcome back to Ebony Maria. Happy Saturday. I am up just getting my day started, about to clean up, and I actually had to get up and get my son ready so he can get his haircut. Your haircut look nice. And um, yeah, so now I guess why him and her go, I mean why him and her, why he go take your side to get his haircut, me and Ray Ray. Go get up, try to get ourselves together so we could go eat lunch and um stuff like that. So um, and we're gonna take them somewhere. He likes for the rain again, but yeah. So we're just gonna get up, get our day started. We're gonna go eat lunch, take them somewhere, probably come home and chill. Um, for some, you know, for a little bit or whatever. And that's gonna be it for right now. I'll be back later. What? We're wrong. Mm. Oh, so yeah. Okay, I'll be back, y'all.
Never say that. I don't want pipe down, rather get paid back. Mama told me never see where you lay at. I don't want righteousness. I hurt too much. I lost too much. I lost too much. I hit my clutch and boom. Her day pop out the tune. I like when you put your gun. Woo, child, we finally finished. I finally finished cleaning up. We all done got showered and dressed. The boys back from getting the haircuts. Josiah, where you at? Oh, it's dark. You can't see you. <laughs> so, we finna go get something to eat. I think everybody agreed on Texas Roadhouse. First time we agreed that quickly <laughs> on where to eat. Um, the weather do look like it's about to rain again, but it should be okay throughout the day. So, yeah, we finna get us something to eat. And I know he said we gotta go by the store because I get them dogs, some dog food or something like that. And that's really it for the Saturday. Just chill. So yeah, I'll be back. Let me get the program. Take it to Making it bread over. Making it bread up. 